talk to you again? The damage on this pillar is missing, and it wasn't changed when they remodeled. If this really is the Karabe's house, then it should be right here. Chihiro left a dent in this pillar. And they could have fixed it, right? Back on my parents' property, there was a wooden single-story house. It was built in the middle of the 20th century. That humble little place stood for about a hundred years. My grandfather often told me stories about it. Some of his fondest childhood memories were at that house. That sounds lovely. I'll have it produced for you. You will. But all I have left are old photographs. That's fine. I can restore them for you. Thank you, Mirasan. I'm looking forward to it. Were you just on a call with someone else? With Professor Karabe, yes. We were discussing the layout of the residential zone. Oh, that's right. Professor Karabe was born in the 21st century. She's 120 years old, right? I know that she's receiving nanomachine treatment, but she still looks so young. She's Professor Morimura's mentor, I hear. Quite an intelligent individual. Well, yeah. She is the foremost expert on AI, after all. Right. Anyway, is something wrong? Why does something have to be wrong for me to call? Well, I just so happen to have a really urgent problem. I need emotional support stat. And I need it from you. Oh, that does sound urgent. Then I'll be waiting. <laughs> okay. So apparently he does eventually get with her. Maybe, possibly. Um, let's do power squat. Cool. Cool. Hey, Anixor. Oh wait. Shinonome's condition is a bit worrying, but Nachan is my priority. Maybe if I ask around, I can retrace her steps. This place is a dump. Cool. Can't go wrong with apple juice. Me and Nachan used to drink it all the time when we were kids. Cool. There you are. I've been... Are you upset with me? <sighs> Just been antsy without my cigarettes. Someone's drawing their handkerchief. Wonder which girl this belongs to. The wind feels nice. Been keeping this place all to yourself, huh? You heard anything about that fire in the North Building? No, I'm sorry. I don't know any... It's been several days since Minami-san had... Okay, we, ha we know that one. Don't you have anything? Takamiya-san. There's that conversation. So? Let's take a look and see what our, our hints are here. A girl's bathroom key. I'm not playing pretend, you know. Uh, yet. Um. Hmm. What should... What should we look at? All right, we're gonna run through these real quick and make sure there's nothing new. Oh, now we can look at this stuff to change. Yeah. We could go to the front gate. Ryoko seems like she's complete, but she's the one who told me to hide that box in the first place. What follows is. Close that for now. I met I. An extraterrestrial being. Okay. So let's see where we can go from here. Should... One more. What should we look? Ask her to go to the shrine. 
That's how we ended the last one. So, what is this? This is. Oh, that's Amaguchi's test. again. Yep. Okay. End of the school building. Did you see that cute handkerchief? The one tied to the fence on the roof? I wonder whose it is. You think it's some sort of sign to her lover? <sighs> oh. God damn. He says there's some spike. Okay. I'm trying to think, like, what, what can we do differently? Um... Oh, we were on track for the shrine, but did another thing. Let's do this. Let's do let's do the front gate. Let's do this. We're gonna do the. We'll, we'll try the shrine. I have finally. Is there another thing down here? Oh, there is. Yeah. Arrived from outer space. In summary, what follows is an investigative record. He said. It's Sentinel Seventeen. So is it the first one? It must be the first one. What follows it I have Which one was it? That's extraterrestrial being. The third one? What follows He says he Sentinel seventeen. Let's go to the front gate. Guess I'll grab my it is bag. A Oh, I'll go with you. Okay. What? So it's the third one, right? These are sorry to make you wait. Tokisakash, maybe not either way. Shall we get? Boom. Ko has been taking his pills. Clearly, 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 clearly. I searched every inch of this damn place. And I still got nothing. Oh, thinking face. Co co hmm. Something that the girl on the track team mentioned. She said Nachon went into the locker room to get a box and described it as some kind of. Hmm. hmm. It's gotten quite dark. Why don't we call it a day? Yeah, all right. Mm. <sighs> Maybe we're going about this the wrong way. Oh, that's it. Okay. A fruitless effort. All right. All right. Shinonome's condition is a bit worrying, but Nachan is my priority. Maybe if I ask. Can't go wrong with me. Okay, so going to the front gate is what triggers this part. So if we want to try to get this key, then we can't go to the front gate. Are you upset? <sighs> Just been and Don't you have anything? Let's try going down here. Nice. Maybe we can trigger that conversation. Keeping this place all to yourself. And then go back up to the roof. Did you see that cute handkerchief? The one tied to the fence on the roof? I wonder whose it is. You think it's some sort of sign to her lover? Oh. Oh. Thank you, Dankus Canadian. <gasps> What's up, dude? Oh, God. Huh? Oh, God. Why are you here? It's a public roof, ain't it? I mean, I guess. I guess it's a public roof. I said, why are you here? Just checking if my handkerchief was dry yet. That handkerchief was yours? Yeah. 
So what? <laughs> I thought it was a girl's. <laughs> I heard there was a fire in the North Building. I also heard that it was caused by a certain cigarette-smoking delinquent. You trying to accuse me of something? First of all, I don't smoke. Second of all, the fire was in the girls' bathroom. And rumor has it, it wasn't even really a fire. Danny. Something happened in the girls' bathroom of the North Building. Something happened. So about Notch, I mean, Minami. What are you getting embarrassed for? You've called her that since you were kids, right? Right. So, Notchon, you know she's gone missing? Yeah, I do know. I suspect the black suits have something to do with that. Why do you say that? I saw Minami being chased by them one time. You what? What the hell is going on? Tim Four Eyes never mentioned that little detail. I also heard rumors about some kid in middle school. I guess he's been looking for her too. Something fishy's going on, but it's getting complicated. I can't keep up. <clears throat> the agent on Nachan's case, Shino Nome. Do I have to ask her for help after all? I mean. She is pretty messed up, too. <sighs> Have I answered enough of your questions yet? Get lost. What a root! I think it may be ill-advised to associate with hoodlums. I want to take a let's go to that girl's bathroom in the north building. Certainly. Holy shit. Are you seeing this? There's no way all this was from a fire. Not one burn mark in sight. Seems more like a bear went on a rampage. These scratch marks, they're carved pretty deep in there. There's signs of damage all over the place. This can't have been the work of just one person. Someone's eyeglass frames. Oh, damn. They're red. Probably belong to a girl. Any ideas? Who do you think these glasses belong to? Well, the glasses are broken, so they won't be wearing them anymore. Do you remember anyone wearing a pair like that? Now that I think about it, yeah, I do remember someone, Nachan's friend in Class 1B, and a name on Four Eyes' list, Tomi Kisaragi. Tomi Kisaragi. I think I saw her in the class one hallway just now. I gotta find her. Wait. We are not allowed to be in here. Oh, we'll get in so much trouble if they find us. What is wrong with you? It just feels like we're actual detectives now. Judging from this level of destruction, I deduce that the perpetrator was someone with an extreme hatred for girls' bathrooms. Uh... I have constructed a criminal profile. Hmm. Our suspect is a maintenance lady built like a bear. What do you think? Mm. This isn't how I expected a crime scene to look. In mystery novels, the perpetrator's name is always written somewhere in blood. Yeah, when there's a dead body nearby. You really are strange. Leon! Maybe whoever those glasses belong to knows something. 
Oh, wait for me. She's literally Iba. I know, right? There's so many tangents. It's crazy. Please don't run off like that so suddenly. I can't keep up. She was somewhere around here before. Not here either. Hey. Yeah? Are these your glasses? What's this all about? Go ahead. Take a closer look. Well, they do look the same as mine, but you probably noticed. I'm wearing mine right now, so obviously they can't be mine. Hmm. You went to the girls' bathroom in the North Building, that right? What happened there? Oh, what's with all the questions anyways? I know you were there. Are you talking about what happened in the North Building? I had nothing to do with it. Why would I go all the way there to use the bathroom anyways? <sighs> Probably a different version of her. All right, listen up. These glasses were found on the floor of the bathroom. And you're the only one in this whole damn school that wears glasses as distinctive as these. So you're blaming me? What could I possibly gain from setting a toilet on fire? Fire? You're not messing with me, are you? Actually... Yeah? I saw her. The day of the incident, Usami-chan was in the North Building. What? Miwako, what the hell? But I really did see you there. I saw Natsuno-chan there too. Wait, what? That's your buddy. Like, what? You gonna, you gonna, you gonna do this right in front of her? I feel bad for making them wait for me. I should hurry up and get these to the art room. <sighs> oh, Natsuno-chan! Miwako! Aren't you supposed to be at training? Where are you off to in such a hurry? Where isn't really the... <sighs> Sorry, Miwako! What was that about? Hmm? Uh, Usami-chan? What happened to your leg? Did you hurt yourself? <sighs> she ignored me? That's not like Usami-chan. So wait, I, one of those must have been the droid? Oh, I've never even seen that place. Seriously, Miwako? But I... Huh. What's going on? Yui-chan, so I was saying... But that can't be right. No, it's true. I really did see them. That's the day we were waiting for you outside. And Usami-chan was with me the whole time. At the front gate, remember? Uh, that's right. Derp. But what about Nachan? I, I mean... How did Natsuno Minami look? Hmm... She was in a hurry. She had her bag. Oh, yeah! On my way back from delivering the copies, I saw another girl. But she was covered in dust. It was really weird. And now that I think about it, she was coming from where the bathroom was. Who was it? Hmm. Well, she looked mild-mannered. And I know I've seen her face around you before, but I don't know which year or class. Good talk. What's wrong? Oh, it's just that I think... I think I forgot something. I'm gonna go get it now. So two Tomi Kisaragis. And a girl covered in dust. What in the hell happened in the girl's bathroom? Wow, we're almost done. Okay. Um. Oh. <laughs> well, well. 
Okay. <sighs> Hello, rude girl. Oh, really? I was good. I said I would leave around 1.30 today. I'm, we'll go ahead and finish this one before I go. Yeah. So what I think we're going to do is tomorrow. I said I was going to play Witcher 3 today. So I think we'll play Witcher 3 tomorrow morning. And then maybe we'll start doing like Witcher 3 in the morning and this game in the afternoon. Um, I might even slide this. But oh, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, tomorrow we're going to do Witcher 3. And then uh, Thursday we'll... We'll do so. And all these cars are so blocky. They look so weird. Oh, wait, is she in the future? Wait, what? Oh, I think I've seen signs like that before. No, we have DF tomorrow just afternoon. Like in those retro mm -hmm. videos I've seen under the Showa era tag. This is kind of surreal. Oh, she's from the future, not Even the, the past. Even the stoplights here are huge. Maybe. Stop wandering off on your own, Kisaraki. Wait, okay, for real though. They seriously haven't invented smartphones yet? <laughs> this is so crazy. How do they even talk to each other? <sighs> Whee! I had a lot of sugar today. A lot of sugar. A lot of sugar. Okay. Um. Oh. Whoa. Oh, oh my god. We really are in the 80s. I can't believe that hair. What? <laughs> Sorry, I just can't stop laughing. What even is that? A pompadour? The show air is so weird. And what the hell are you laughing at? Huh? Your hair, duh. I just said. You trying to start shit? <sighs> Please excuse us. I'm afraid she's a little... Well, she has difficulty with social interaction. Hey! Don't make me sound like some kind of weirdo. Please, carry on. I'll give her a talking to once we're home. Goddamn freaks. Now I wonder if this is the well, droid or the human. Day. Stop causing problems. You realize we're only here with the help of this era's facilitators. If we're to be accepted here, we must respect the place. We're essentially foreign refugees. Don't forget that. Facilitators. So, about those facilitators. You mean Shikishima? The military corporation? Am I getting a pompadour? Oh yeah, by tomorrow for sure. You sure we're not being used? That is not your concern. Sakura High. I trust you know where to find it. It's the same school. I expect you'll adjust quickly. That is not my school. Everyone from that class is old enough to be my mom. Don't act like it's the same. We left mine back in 2025. Take me back to my own time. I thought I explained this already. The world was destroyed. Okay, fine. Let's say that's true. I've still got to go help my mom and dad. They won't be there. It's already too late. I doubt you'd get the clearance to time jump anyway. That another one of their orders? I didn't want to get dragged into this. Am I supposed to just take it? Whatever you say? Precisely. You should count yourself lucky to have escaped with us. Kisaragi-kun, I understand your situation, but I need you to cooperate. Okay. I never saw it myself. The world was destroyed, apparently. What do I even say to that? Yeah, cool. Got it. Still, even if I begged to go check it out, something tells me they aren't gonna let me. What I need is a little leverage over them. I gotta make them an offer they can't refuse. 
So in 2025, I would have turned 16 next month. But now, I'm way back in 1985. So like, how old am I, technically? I remember seeing that company in the news back in 2025. They make everything from fridges to missiles. They've got tons of factories across the world. Until further notice, here are your orders. Do not act on your own. Remain inconspicuous. And for now, simply attend school as usual. Am I clear? Johnny Rocket, thank you for the 17 months, buddy. I appreciate it. Usami-chan, did you check out all those books? What are they? Hey, do you mind if I take a look? They're not that interesting. I just want to peek. Let's see. Business Quarterly? Corporate Guides. Economic Reports. This is impressive, Usami-chan. Are you studying for a career in business? Uh, not really. I was kind of looking for some leverage. You know, dirt on some big shady corporation. So then I could, like, control them a little. Huh? Usami-chan, that's a little... weirder than I was expecting. So everything back home's but Yeah, right. I gotta get left. So in Shikishima's a conglomerate with political ties. They made it big during the Meiji modernization. You always see their branches on Employer of the Year list. Back in the Meiji era, they were shipbuilders, but they expanded into aviation and a bunch of other things. During the war, they did a lot of weapons R&D, and now they make everything from home appliances to rockets. Shikishima Industries is just one of those branches. Their machinery is known all over the world. I could do this in a snap if I had internet here. Manually searching through books? So inconvenient. Right? Internet? Uh, oh, uh, like, you know, net profits, big business talk, <laughs> or something. I've been meaning to tell you. I found a cafe with some amazing looking cakes. Shall we go there after school? Sounds good. Those crepes from yesterday are gonna be hard to beat though. Back home, they went a little too crazy with the toppings. Sometimes simple is best. Kiss principle. Yeah. I scoured the whole library for reference materials. Wasn't hard to find things on Shikishima, but it's just like stock market stuff. <laughs> I should have known. Nothing I could use as leverage. Check her out. How does one person sleep that much? Hey, Miwako. I know this is random, but there's this company called Shikishima Industries. You know anything about them? Shikishima. They're the ones who make ships and things, right? Hmm. I have this old friend. His father works for them, I think. Seriously? Miwako, can you do me a favor? I want you to introduce me. Sure. Yes. Those big megacorps always have shady stuff hiding in their HQ. One nice. step closer hey, Sir to getting the dirt. So in 20... You said your friend goes to the school, right? They're still not here. Did you get the meeting time wrong? No. Did they just ditch? Oh, don't worry. He'll be here soon. He's not the type to break promises. Him? What's up? Yeah. I'm here. It's that Pompadour guy. Hold on. What's he doing here? Uh, this is my old friend, Nanji Ogata. You're kidding. So, uh, where's she at? You said some girl was looking to ask me out. What? Well, um, uh, that would be her, Usami-chan. Huh? You're the chick who shat on my hair. Real dog face, aren't you? The heck is that supposed to mean? I take it you're not calling me a cute puppy. OK, 
Okay, hold up. What did you say to this guy? Just that a girl I knew wanted to tell him something. And he thought that was a confession? Oh, heck. How dumb is he? I'm standing right here. Why'd it have to be you? The feeling's mutual, man. Please, can we all calm down? There you are. I've been looking all over for you. Ah! What was... Huh? I could have sworn I just saw them. only said that the gates and the giant robots could shift. So does that also mean that the smaller robots could shift? Damn it. Still alive over there, Captain Pompadour? Oh, the only My safe way to shift. Is Nenji Ogata. Mm. Get it straight, dog face. Oh, excuse me, Captain Pompadour. I'm Tomi Kisaragi. Don't give me any stupid nicknames. All right, smartass. Please, we can't be fighting right now. She didn't hurt herself. That's, that was my first thought. <sighs> what happened to all these buildings? It's like... We were attacked. <sighs> uh, uh, wait, he knows? Do you know something? I know the city got leveled. You saw that flash, right? Must have been a nuke. Uh, a nuclear bomb? You realize we were at school just now. Isn't this downtown? Way I figure it. The blast must have knocked us all the way over here. Okay, never mind. You're just a moron. Hey! You're like a big greasy roach. I bet you could survive a nuke no problem. <sighs> you got a better idea? the hell else could have happened oh, if we're here then no way if it's nuclear war then that means there's radiation everywhere we're going to die we have to run or get cover or deep breaths me i mean she's not wrong that's exactly what they should yeah i mean Kayakicho. Huh? Oh, you're right. Look at that sign. It must be near the shopping district. The hell? You know how far that is from school? Look, I don't know what the hell happened, but nobody else is here. Think they all evacuated? Oh, then where? Everything messed up like this, but I think we're in the year 2025. 2025? Are you crazy? This is my home. Well, was my home, I guess. In case I didn't mention, I came from the future. You know. 
Well, damn! This game's nutty, dude. This game is nutty. Uh, I have to say, I'm glad we continued playing it because this is uh, this has been a bit of a ride. We've now played this game eight and a half hours, and uh, I I think we're gonna keep playing it. I I don't know when exactly. Probably like Thursday afternoon. Um, but yeah, I I think we're gonna keep playing this game. This has been kind of fun, and I and I kind of want to see where it goes and how crazy and weird this ride we're on is gonna go. So we'll see, we'll see. That being said, uh, I am out for now. I'm gonna be off the rest of the afternoon. I'm gonna be back around 6.30 p.m. ET and we are gonna play at least a couple hours of Hades. We're gonna open the beers early and we're just gonna relax. We're gonna do the best we can, especially as Americans, to just relax and uh, and let the evening happen. So yeah, that's the plan. So I will see all of you fine folks at 6.30 p.m. ET for some cozy Hades, the coziest Hades we've ever done. And, uh, and I will see all you then. Tomorrow is going to be probably Witcher 3 in the morning because I want to get back to Witcher 3. I was going to do some this afternoon, but um, I clearly kept playing this game. So uh, we're going to do Witcher 3 tomorrow, probably make some progress in Heart of Stone. And I've got drop frames in the afternoon, I think. Um, if we don't have drop frames for any reason, then I'll probably play more of this game. Um, and then Thursday, we'll do maybe a split stream in the morning, maybe Witcher 3 and the other one. And then I'm probably off Thursday afternoon like I normally am. And uh, Friday, maybe a full day again, back to like nice big chunks of both. And of course we've got the cozy stream coming up as well. So all sorts of stuff coming on. Anyway, guys, I'm out of here. Have a great morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are around the globe. As always, thank you so much for spending some of your life here. And I will see you fine folks this evening for some cozy Hades and lots of beer or tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. ET for more fun and games. Bye-bye.